Hi Aries, welcome to my channel. This is a next 24 hours tarot reading session for you Aries. I hope you are well. I hope you are fine and safe and doing good Aries. This reading for today, this is for you. Let us see what is happening towards you guys. What is the message that is meant for you to know, ready for you to know. This is for the sign of Aries, okay? Before I start, guys, I would like to thank you for coming back. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the bell, click the bell now and click subscribe. And if you would like to further connect with me, Aries, I invite you to check out the description box below. You would see the details of my website. It will have all of the details of the products and the services that we offer outside of the YouTube platform, okay? Let's see what's happening towards you, Aries, okay? your next 24 hours reading let's pick up love career finance and general situationship for you okay okay all right so you've got a knight of cups okay you've got a page of swords and you've got a five of swords okay um okay you have a knight of cups you have an offer okay um could be cancer scorpio pisces this is a gemini libra aquarius um this is another um gemini libra aquarius energy i feel like there is a person or a situation at the moment you know sorry guys i'm just gonna move my mic okay sorry guys i'm just gonna move my mic all right just give me a second yeah. <clears throat> so there's a person there's a situation at the moment there's a person there's a situation and it could be a relationship or it could be because the knight of cups this is sincere it's also talking about sincerity loyalty it's an emotional offer you know it's it's cup it, it's connected to emotions it could be an emotional support it could be a lover it could be a friend it could be you know a partner it it is a person you know it's more of a person now, this Knight of Cups, who I feel like you're also interested with the Knight of Cups and their offer, this person exists in your life, you know, or is still energ energetically connected with you. Um, the Page of Swords is looking into the Knight of Cups. It could be that you will receive a message from this person or you're about to reply or follow up because it, it, look, it looks like an outgoing energy. So it's possible that you follow up or you're you're gonna get something someone will follow it could be you could be them but there's a message there is there's an exchange of message coming through between the two of you now you have doubt you know five of swords with this person but you're playing it like you are not making it obvious that you have doubt with them yeah hermit card i would say you're playing it cool or you're playing it safe in here Aries you know with the knight of cups the hermit card you're playing it cool you're playing it safe the hidden energy of this knight of cups this is not you this is definitely coming from external the hermit card the hermit card is outward I feel like it is you guys are both um, there's something I would say there's something that you need to crack the code in here like there's something in here Aries that's hidden i feel like this knight of cups the hermit card there's a hidden information there's a hidden agenda there's a hidden feelings in here that you're trying to yeah ten of wands the judgment card so page of swords the, the the ten of wands and this is your energy it's a feeling where you gotta follow up then they will respond if you don't do if you don't push the button you won't get it okay so there's, there's a part of you that you need to to get a hey to give them a nudge a hey oi then you get what you want so you're getting something but you've got to follow up you've got to chase you you know there's a part of you that five of swords why do i need to chase or why do i need to ask second time or third time to get it like there's a part of you j judgment card you know like this is the part why do i need to beg or why do I need to like hey you know like hey so there's a part of you that's kind of 
I don't know, maybe you need to fight them to be with you or there's a, there's a part of you that something is here, but you, you got to do something to, to get the attention, okay? It's, it's, it doesn't feel good. It's, it actually feels annoying, Aries, to be in this position where for this person to work or to do the job or to be with you or to reply to you, you got to follow up and you're tired of that because, hey, how many times will I do that? How many times will I be sitting in this position or energy where I have to give you a nudge, I have to give you a hey, oi, what's up, and then you reply, and then you respond. So there's a there's something within you that you're kind of tired in this repetitive cycle of you doing the work or the nudge, or maybe you keep forgiving them. You keep giving them the benefit of the doubt or there's something with you that you're giving in spite of like you're giving, you're patient, you're responsive but then they never they never really do what they're supposed to do something tells me yeah. then it wants you know like it's here but it's difficult I mean something is here but it's difficult something is here but it's complicated something is here but it's heavy but it's here it's kind of feeling I have something but it's heavy it's complicated vibe you know <clears throat> you've got a three of cups in here the nine of cups and the high priestess i mean i'm seeing you in this person or situation you will work together you'll be together you probably date together three of cups nine of cups i mean but you're more you, you it, it's like a you're more than friends but less than a lover or there's definitely something there's there's an element of love there's an element of support there's some element of good vibe in here, but you ha you want more than the Three of Cups. Three of Cups, this is dating, getting to know. This is laughing, eating, drinking. You want this person to Knight of Cups you, to give you more Knight of Cups, to be open about their feelings, to be open about their plan, to be open, to be open about their whereabouts to be honest with you to be transparent with you five of swords you're manifesting this person to be more and more open transparent um to act more like you yeah to give what you're giving them let's see let's see the advice for you aries there's a will of fortune There's a page of cups in here and the six of pentacles i feel like with this energy aries it's kind of it's it's it with the will of fortune you guys are you're guys on the right track you guys are on the you're still in synchronicity it means that this person is still going to be part of your life it's it's part of your life it's here with the page of cups i don't know what happened between the two of you but it seems to be in this reading you're more of the follow-up you're more you're more of the chaser in here aries six of pentacles i feel like you kind of you're the chaser you invest and invest and invest there will come a point that you would stop doing that and you kind of will see whether this person is going to react yeah tower card i feel like I feel like there I feel Aries that there's a part of you that you still need to somehow be patient uh, I don't know give them the benefit of the doubt there's a part of you that's somehow still willing to wait that there's a part of you that would chase that there's a part of you that okay I'm, I'm gonna follow up I'm gonna do it for do it for them like in the name of love I'm gonna do it there's a part of you that still would like to be part of them even though some of the move you have to initiate okay now page of cups six of pentacles but at some point you will get tired okay I I feel like you're doing everything to you're, you're doing everything you're doing everything because you want to make it work but you at some point you, you will have your you will reach your limit in here Aries because you've got a tower card so there's gonna poop you know like one day you're just gonna burst into an energy a fireball and you're gonna burn this you know because you're not built to be a chaser at some point you would like to have 
a repros uh, an equal approach in here but i feel like right now you're still patient in in this reading yeah ten of pentacles like i feel like there will come a point where you have to blast this person burst of passion and fears to wake them up and shaking shake them up and say ten of pentacles because you're getting you're getting a six it's like com this is like complacent codependent like this is neutral you want a 10 and you you have to do some tower moment to wake up and shake up this person yeah let's see ace of wands yeah you know <clears throat> and you've got a ten of pentacles and the ace of wands in here it seems to be if you shake them up if you wake them up i don't know maybe you're gonna give them an ultimatum but after that you've got a ten of pentacles ace of wands so it seems to be things will work in your favor you know i'm really getting like at some point it will push you to do something above and beyond it will push you to give them like a final notice a final remind reminder like a verdict and it seems to be it's kind of effective in here aries okay hangman the three of wands the world card and the queen of cups yes you're going to challenge this person they will react not instantly you're going to challenge this person or situation they're going to react but not as soon as possible like it won't be as soon as possible but they will react you know they will look into the they're, they're going to look at their future and they're going to look at their future f feature future and they they see your future with you they want to bring with there and they really need to be emotionally available for you or emotionally connect with you if they want to make this happen because you're going to give them an ultimatum yeah you know because if you don't if they don't act fast you're going to leave them three of swords and five of cups it it will hurt them more than you are in here in this reading okay wow so yeah so you shake them up you wake them up and that is where you get the ten of pentacles the ace of wands it could also be a new beginning that if you kind of separate yourself to this person you have a beginning and then they're they're sad that you left them but in here there's gonna be a big turn of events and it is a wake-up call to your person they might not react right away or the i feel like you're, you're going to leave this person or situation or company a friend whoever it is at some point the chase being patient won't make won't work it could be like a drastic decision to leave to say goodbye to drop it off or to be missing in action that would be you and boom that's where you get the that's where this person scared three of wands mm. it's scary not to see aries in my future the world card that is queen of cups they contemplate and they feel three of swords and five cups no there's no way i could live without aries so they're gonna keep their promise probably chase you but this is not over this is just the beginning aries big time so this is what i have for you guys thank you so much and i'll see you soon again guys you have a great day